This I wanna nail sports to the one Top blog out of the YouTube channel No matter which sports here we got it covered Subscribe and hit the notification bell What's up my wonderful peeps? Sports to the bone here again man Shout out to all the viewers, subscribers and the followers Big up on yourself Alright my viewers and subscribers So early in the morning I have some good news for you guys I must say it was indeed a pleasure losing my night rest to watch our spinners go to work. I enjoyed every bit of it. You know, I watched the game right up until lunchtime when Brathwaite and Blackwood, you know, batted those four overs. So I am going to I am going to be going through um how things went, the wickets that we took. And thing like that, you understand? So just bear with me, my viewers and subscribers. And before we go down in all of that, I'm just going to ask you, if you have not yet subscribed to this channel, my peeps, I'm going to ask you to go right ahead and hit that subscribe button. Turn on the post notification bell. So once we drop a video, you will be updated. All right, first things first. Versami Permal and Warikan. I must congratulate them for such an outstanding bowling performance. You know, uh, our coach, he spoke yesterday in an interview and I was saying, well, if you have your plan or your plan not getting people out, then I don't know what kind of plan that is. And on the second day, my viewers and subscribers, the plan sure did come together as Permal ripped through the Sri Lanka batting lineup. Yeah, man. I, I am not even going to let the, the batsman the, the batsman distract me from what the bowlers did. You understand? Um Mr. Bowling Coach, I apologize to you, sir. Congratulations for getting such good performance. Um our performances out of two of our, our um our, our frontline spinners. You understand? So resuming on what was it? 113 for one or something like that. Sri Lanka, they were looking very poised. They were looking as if they wanted to put up a mammoth total. But Permal and Warikan had different ideas, my viewers and subscribers. Different plans. Both men shared the spoils, you know. As the morning session, they, they went ripping through Sri Lanka's um wall. You understand? Brick by brick, they took Sri Lanka apart. Yeah, man. Permal was actually the one that got the breakthrough, picking up um, Nisanka. Yeah, man. He got Nisanka out for 73. Nisanka was looking set to get another century. You understand? But Permal had him trapped in front LBW. So you know, Nisanka went in for 73 of 148 deliveries. And, um, yeah, man, we, we know that current Naratni, he was dismissed already by Rastan Chase on day one. Now, this is where the collapse began, began, my viewers and subscribers. I didn't even get a chance to fall asleep. Usually, when we are in this bowling, you know, I, I would fall asleep, wake up, fall asleep, wake up. But to how intense this was, I, did, I watched every ball of it. You understand? Fernando, he was nicely... Caught by Joshua De Silva. Yeah, man. Very good catch behind behind the wicket. Uh, Matthews. He was out there. He got injured. Had to come off. Think he picked up a thigh strain. Then he came back on. Was not able to run. So, you know, he was he was there trying to, to swing away. Got a couple of sixes. You know, made 29 from 45. The Silva. Um, you know, he was he was he was also dismissed by Versami Permal by a brilliant catch by, by Joshua Da Silva behind the wicket. Um Asalanka, he came, he looked as if he wanted to bring the heat. I think his first run was a boundary that he, he played a reverse sweep if I'm not mistaken for four. But Versami Permal had him caught by Nkuma Bonner. Um Chandimal he played across the line well it actually swept at, at, at a ball missed was hit right in front by Jamal Warikan plum plumber than a plumber fixing a pipe he got two off eight Mendes he came Jamal Warikan had him playing to 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 um to to she hope who took the catch you know Lakmal he was looking dangerous he didn't look for any single everything came he wanted to hit for four but versus Permal you know, he had him caught by Jamar Warikan. And that is basically 
basically how their their batting went my viewers and subscribers you understand um the next batsman m bondina he got one and the next one didn't didn't um didn't score so that was how it went my viewers and subscribers west indies they really really worked well with the ball so we're talking about after 106 for one um they went you know we know they, they, they went up to 113 then we got 139 for two 152 for three 154 for four 169 for five 169 for six 178 for seven yeah man 187 187 for eight then they go what 200 and 200 for nine and 204 for ten so you know we we really we really worked them so for those who stayed up i i can just i can just imagine how how good you are feeling within yourself now knowing that you sacrificed your sleep to watch um to, to watch our bowlers at work and in all honesty my viewers and subscribers after the when we went off for lunch i didn't even want to sleep you know but i said here what whatever the batsmen um come out and do I will look at it tomorrow. I am going to my bed with this good feeling that the bowl has um, made me happy. You understand? I said, hear what? Whatever the batsmen come out there and do, I am not going to see this tonight. Tomorrow I will look at the square and I will talk about it. But these bowlers, I am I am definitely going to be going to be going to my bed with um you know with the, with the good feeling that they would have provided. So that is that is how it went. Now, in terms of the overs, just the, the pace bowlers, they didn't even have to do anything. I can't remember seeing Kim Roach with the ball. I can't remember seeing him. When, when I started watching him, I wasn't sleeping, but when I started watching, I think about two or three overs were, um, was bowled before I started. So I don't know if those guys bowled it before. But um, from the moment I started watching it, I, it's only the spinners I see operating. When I turned on, I saw Rastan Chase bowling, and then it was just Warwick and Permal right through. So Kemar Roach, six overs, two maiden. 12 runs. I think that was from the first day. Jason Wola, 8 overs, 2 maidens, um, 23 runs. Kyle Myers, 2 overs from the first day, just the same. 0 maiden, 13 runs. Versami Permal, 13 overs, 3 maidens, 35 runs, 5 wickets at an economy rate of 2.68. You understand? Rastan Chase, he bowled 14 overs for 64 runs and the one wicket that he took on the first day. Rastan Chase was a bit short and wide, was a bit wayward, almost allowed Shea Hope to go to the hospital, just like Jeremy Solazano. You know, he bowled a short ball, and the batsman pulled it ferociously, and, you know, Shea Hope was right there at bat pad. He had to sight it. Look how most we had at the concussion sub getting concussed. <laughs> yeah, man. Um, Jamar Warikan, you know, he was, he was very impressive. He, he finished off with the best um economic um economy rate of all the bowlers that bowled over over um over seven overs. So he got um 18.3 overs out of the way. Um bowled five maidens, 50 runs, and he went um he took four wickets at 2.70. Now the only reason he conceded 50 runs is because in the latter part there you know, they, they were trying to float up some deliveries to Angela Matthews to see if he would miscue and hit the ball. And, and well, he would miscue and the ball go up in the air and they take a catch, you know. So Matthews took, took him for a couple of sixes. So that is why he got, he, he, he got all the way up there. But yes, my viewers and subscribers, I am indeed impressed with what the bowlers did. You know, um, Joshua the Silva also. Joshua the Silva was extremely good behind the stump. Took a, sh took a couple of sharp catches. The first wicket that fell. That one was extremely sharp. You understand? He was keeping up on the batsman. Flashed that one. Cut it. And he was able to take a brilliant catch. You know, usually if you don't have an, have a, have a, um, if you don't have a, 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 a keeper that is a specialist. You know, from time to time they, they, they put down those type of catches. Yeah man, um I think I think I think the, the catch was to, to dismiss um uh yeah man da sil um da silva yeah man I think um silver Joshua da Silva he, he he took the catch to to dismiss Silva and, and Sri Lanka's team. He was he was very good, he was very good. You know, he was sharp behind the stump, he, he was chatty, 
It was noisy making a lot of noise, talking of talking, you know, cheering up the bowlers. Um combined with uh what's his name? Combined with with Bonner, you know, that silver they were putting on the pressure on the batsmen. So it was good to see them um at work, my viewers and subscribers. Not very often we get a chance to see West Indies on top like that. And just to round it off with the bat our batsmen went out there and they they did not score fast but the good thing is that they did not lose they didn't lose uh much wicket they they lost only one wicket german blackwood he 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 scored he scored at a okay pace got in for, getting 44 of 99 and five of those and 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 you know he got five fours out of that yeah you know um craig brathwaite He's there on 22 of 77 and Nkuma Bana is 1 of 4. Um, when, when I finished watching, when I, when I left, when I was going to my, my bed at lunchtime, you know, when Brathwaite and, and Blackwood carried it up to lunch after facing four overs and they were at two runs, I was saying to myself, boy, this is survival mode and I'm not sure how long we'll be able to survive just, 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 um, just defending and not pushing out at all. You know, but it, it's it's good to wake up and see sixty nine for one, even though even though um sixty nine for one, you know, came off twenty nine point four overs, you know, so that means we are trailing by what a hundred and thirty five runs, and when when we were bowling, um when we had ter when we had thirty four overs, Sri Lanka had over over um over a hundred and and had runs so. We are we are we are a little behind, but I will let nothing take away from what our bowlers did last night, my viewers and subscribers. Um, they 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 bowl extremely well, and I you know, as I said, it was a pleasure staying up and watching these guys do their thing. Funny enough, it's the first time since the series I am actually you know I I was actually able to stay up and watch a full a full um full session. So shout out to the guys but yeah man we're gonna leave it right here for now my viewers and subscribers just let me know what you think down there in the comment section about this one sports to the bone guys please remember to like share leave us a comment if you have not yet subscribed please go right ahead and subscribe to the channel i'm out